Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Praise the Lord, dear friends. Uh, welcome again uh, to the episode of uh, Seek Holy Spirit. And if you remember, in the beginning of the year, I started uh, with the gifts of the Holy Spirit. Uh, however, due to the Feast of uh, Epiphany and Baptism of the Lord, I could not finish the last gift, uh, which is the gift of piety, which I plan to cover today. Uh, so let's see the gift of piety. It's mentioned in uh, Isaiah chapter 11, verse uh, 3a. His delight shall be in the fear of the Lord. His delight shall be in the fear of the Lord. Uh, the original translation uh, tells us about uh, the fear that is mentioned here uh, is referring to piety and the gift of piety creates in us uh, a filial affection towards God the Father. Um, it creates uh, a deep love uh, towards Father and uh, for, for the love of God uh, we begin to uh, love uh, people uh, who are consecrated to God, people who are uh, close to God and, uh, and uh, that's what piety does. Uh, it uh, tries to please God and uh, even uh, serving others for God's sake. Uh, piety uh, helps us uh, to serve others um, because um, for the sake of the Lord, for the sake of the Lord we do everything and um, by God's grace uh, a lot of people have been blessed with the gift of piety and they exercise the gift of piety in serving others, in helping others, uh, and in respecting and uh, loving the people who are consecrated uh, to God. And for God's sake, we do everything. And most importantly, uh, it makes the service of God uh, <coughs> not a burden, but a, but but a, but a duty as well as it makes it light. Uh, we never think prayer uh, as a burden, as a heavy duty. Uh, we never think that um, going to church or doing some uh, extra prayers uh, is a difficult task. It, because the gift of piety enables us, uh, we do it out of love uh, and uh, for, the, for His sake we do everything. So let's pray church that we are blessed with the gift of piety that will help others in the ministry and may this gift bless you. The Lord be with you, with your spirit. Almighty God bless you, Father, Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen.